to see you. Welcome to the show. I am Steve Trash. They call me that because I'm a recycler. I find things that other people have thrown away and I make up magic tricks to go with them. Cool stuff like this. I like it. Check it. Somebody threw this away and I thought I should make a magic trick out of it. Check out my magic wand. Nice, right? No expense has been spared for your entertainment pleasure. <laughs> Check it, here we go. La, 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 la. <laughs> no extra charge for the sound effects. Oh, awesome! How did that get in there? Wow, how did that get in there? <laughs> Clapping, cheering, yelling, screaming, happiness! Do you want to see some more? Come on, do you want to see some more? I'm gonna show you some more, check it out. This is so awesome. You guys, any recyclers in the audience? Anybody recycling? Anybody? Thank you for recycling. Thank you for recycling. You know, see, I love recycling because it's kind of similar to magic, right? Because you take one thing and you transform it almost instantly into another thing. <laughs> Nice, right? You wanna see some more? Do you guys wanna see some more? Check this out. I am gonna create a visual illusion. Solid. Through solid. Hey, Roz, good to see you. Solid. Solid pole. Hey, Bethany, is that a solid handkerchief? Indeed it is. Check this out. This is so good. You guys might wanna lean forward just a little bit. Maybe. That's good, right? Solid through solid. Watch. Oh, come on! You want to see it again, right? You want to see it again, right? Ladies and gentlemen, I am here for you. Here we go. Jake, we'll do it again. Watch, solid through solid. That's what I'm talking about. Do you want to see some more? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to show you some more. So here's the thing. I am a recycler. I love recycling. I came up with this aluminum foil recycling magic trick. Now, aluminum is almost infinitely recyclable. So here's the latest and the greatest. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you ready? Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, hit it, A.B. <laughs> I like it. Oh, yeah. That's some recycling music right there, man. Recycle. Are you ready? Are you ready? Watch this. This is crazy good. Watch. Ladies and gentlemen, is the magic of recycling. Wow. Woo! 
All right, did you like that? Do you want to see some more? Well, I want to show you some more. So here's the thing. I am a huge fan of magic tricks. I'm also a huge fan of science. Science and magic are two very different things. Science, study of how the natural world works. Magic, creating the illusion that you can defy the laws of nature. Two different things. Watch this. Science and magic. Science, magic. Pineapple juice. This is science. But this, well, this is magic. That's very nice. Well, thank you all for coming onto the stage. We're gonna do something very special. I need a little mood music. Hit it, A.B. This should be fun. Let's, oh, I have a great idea. I love this idea. Can we, can we do this? What did you tell me your name is? Amaria, so glad to see you. Amaria, would you take your right hand, that's this one right here, hold it out just like this. Amaria, I want you to close your right hand tight into a fist. Open it big, close it tight. Open it big, close it tight. Open it big, leave it open just like that. Stay right there. The magic is gonna happen right here. Are you watching? This is gonna be fantastic. That's my friend, Mr. Sponge. That's my friend, Mrs. Sponge. Amaria, are you ready? Mr. and Mrs. Amaria, please hold Mrs. Sponge. Squish her tight like I have Mr. Mrs. Mr. Mrs. Mr. Everybody, lean in and blow on Mr. Sponge. Notice that he disappears. He goes flying through the air. <laughs> Amaria, open your hands nice and big. <laughs> Nicely done. Good magic. Give it to me, baby. Give it to me. Give it to me. Give it to me. Ba -da -ba -da -ba. Do you want to see some more? Yeah. Oh, I love that. You had no idea you could do real magic, did you? Let's try this. Watch. I think you'll like this a lot. My friend, are you paying attention? This is going to be super duper terrific. I like to reuse things. I found this Secrets box in New York City in 1984. I've used this same box all of these years. And I'm about to create an amazing magic trick. Are you ready? Yeah! These are bottle caps that I also found in New York City all of those years ago. Watch carefully. Will you help me count out loud? One, two, three, four. How many bottle caps? Four. One, two, three, four, yeah. Watch this. It would be cool if we could create a little magic with the bottle caps, wouldn't it? Watch this. Everybody watch closely. Watch the bottle caps. Watch. This one flies. Shoo. 
One, two, three, four. That was pretty fun, right? I have another. Would you like to see another? Yeah. Do you want to see another? Yeah. All right, check this out. Now, this is super duper terrific. I have a brand new deck of cards. You can see the plastic wrapping is still on it. See? See the plastic wrapping? Still on the brand new red deck of cards. Now, I'm going to show you the most extraordinary thing. I'm going to open this pack. Oh, gee. Does it maybe want to open? You think you can? Okay. Pull, pull that little piece of plastic right there. Oh, you are extremely helpful. Pull that all the way off. Fantastic. That was completely sealed, wasn't it? You're a very good helper. Would you guys clap out loud for my helper? Thank you. So let's cut this open. What color is this deck of cards? Yeah, what other color? What's that color? Is it red? Yeah. It's a red deck of cards. Now, the deck has never been opened. So I'm going to take this red deck of cards out. Ready? Watch carefully. Ready? All of the cards, all of the cards are red. Watch this. Red, red. Someone asked me the other day, they said, Steve Trash, you're a green magician, aren't you? And I said, yes, I am. And they said, well, if you're a green magician, why do you use a red deck of cards? And I said, well, that's because being green is about lifestyle. It's who you are. It's it's how you use the planet's natural resources. But I understand what you're saying. Red is also a color. So you guys watch carefully. I want everybody to lean in. And when I say go, I want you to snap your fingers. Just like that. At the red deck of cards. Ready? Set. Go to snap. Go to snap. Go. The red deck instantly transforms. The red deck instantly transforms into a green deck of cards. Uh, and all of the cards. Oh, hey, look over there. La, 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 la. Do, do, look at it. It's a, oh, it's a big monkey on the building. Somebody. Oh, poo. That's, that was, but that one didn't change, did it? Oh, I tell you what. Everybody lean forward and snap your fingers. Ready? The red card. Ready? Go. The red card is now red on both sides. All right, we've got time for one more. Would you like to see one more? You didn't know that you had that magical ability? Now you know. <laughs> can you uh, all do one more? Yes, we can. Let's do this one. This is one of my favorites, OK? Let's do, ooh, I've got an idea. I love Cheerios. I eat Cheerios almost every morning. I love Cheerios. Let's try this. The guys haven't really gotten to help me. Hey, Bryce, would you, would you help me? You can stay right there. There's no such thing as hot cocoa. There is such a thing as hot cocoa. Do you drink hot cocoa sometimes with your Cheerios? Hey, Bryce, please choose two of those Cheerios and put them on the front. <laughs> Get used to it, Bryce. <laughs> Bryce, pick two of the Cheerios. That one's a good one, that one's a good one. Put them on the front. Sweetheart, grab all the other Cheerios that Bryce did not choose and put them back in the Cheerios box. Good job. Here we go. Bryce, my friend, are those the two Cheerios that you chose? Is your right hand or your left hand your magic hand? Right or left? Right hand is probably correct. Take this, take this. These are the two that you chose, right, Bryce? Here we go. Watch this. Bryce, point directly at the two Cheerios that you chose. See the Cheerios? Point directly. Just like this. Watch. Do you remember your magic before? This is Bryce's magic. Watch. As he puts the two 
together. Bryce, you linked those two Cheerios together. <laughs> Nicely done. Bryce, my friend, you get to keep that as a souvenir. There you go. Last one. Everybody ready? Put your hands together like this. Last one, last one. Here we go. Uh oh. Do I have any recyclers in my audience? Do I have any recyclers in my audience? Check it out, I am a recycler. I love to recycle. In fact, I love recycling so much that I keep my recyclable pieces of paper in my wallet. Watch carefully, you'll see this happen. I have recyclable pieces of paper. Everything that is recyclable is valuable. Watch carefully. Are you watching? Come in closer, here we go, ready? Set, and everybody tries together, set, Clapping, cheering, yelling, screaming. Oh, come on! Oh, thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. So I have to tell you the truth. We have been rehearsing this nonstop. It is an unbelievable... It's a real... That's not yours? It's, it's a, oh. Hold it a second. Oh, wait a second. Wait a second. That's my phone. It's, hold it a second, everybody. It's, it's AB. AB is here. Oh, wait a minute, let me see that's AB. Let me, let me, let me, excuse me, I gotta take this. Yo, AB, what's up? What, company's here? Company's coming today? Oh, that's fantastic news. Hey, uh, AB, everybody's here. Can I put you on speakerphone? Great. Okay, hold, hold it a second. I'm going to put you on speakerphone. Hey, Steve, I got great news for you. What's the great news, AB? Hey, company is coming today. Today. That is that is really, really good news. Company's coming today. Uh, AB, do you have any clues yeah, for I us? Yeah, I got three clues for you, Steve. Three clues. Okay. Yeah, yeah. The first clue is your company has talents. Talents? That's right, yeah. Talents. Company has talents. Do you know any? Do you know anything that might have talents? Anything? Yeah. You, you, you pe people. You don't. I, that's highly unlikely. Okay, that's a good clue, AB. You got any more clues? Yes. Clue number two. Your visitor is named as Mel. Yeah, it's very similar to the animals on the hit movie uh, Harry Potter. You know the ones that deliver messages. So Mel mm -hmm. is remarkably similar to the animals that deliver messages in the world of Harry Potter. Okay, so our company today has talons, is named Mel. A.B., do you have any more clues for Last us? Last clue. Last but not least, you can't forget this. Okay. Mailbox flag goes up, company's here. Don't okay. forget, mailbox flag goes up, company has arrived. Okay, got it. Mailbox flag goes up. Yeah. Company's arrived. Company's here. Got it. Thank you, AB. Rock on. See you later. All right. Good, good, good. All right. Everybody, please. This is very, very important. Please pay attention. When the mailbox flag goes up, company has arrived. Company is actually here, okay? So it is... What? What? No, 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 no. When this... This is the red thing. That's the flag. When it goes up, company is actually arrived. It's a... What? No, 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 the flag, it has to be up. That means company has arrived when the flag has... What, are you people messing with me? The flag, the flag actually has to be up. It's like this, for the company to be here, we know the flag is... Oh, you're right, the flag is up. I guess company's arrived, ladies and gentlemen. Company has arrived! Wait a minute! AB said the company had arrived when the flag was up, company's arrived. Oh, I think we have to use the magic words. Let's use the magic words. Do you guys remember the magic words? They are simple. They are reduce, reuse, and recycle. Everybody say the magic words out loud. Reduce, reuse, and recycle. Oh, cool! Check it out. Company has arrived. 
I don't know, but companies arrive. Let's see. Dun, 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 dun. That's an empty box. That's not that's not very good. Could you take that for me, Raza? Ah! Company's Wait a minute. That's just a piece of paper! <laughs> Bethany, could you take that for me? You it's probably a note, right? You think it's a note? Let's see what it says. I'm a reader. Here we go. It says, <laughs> it says, look inside the magic box. You guys see a magic box? In the <laughs> what? Good thinking. That looks very magical to me. That is probably, wait a second. Wait, 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 wait. It says, very important, wear gloves. Hmm. Why do you suppose I would need to wear gloves? Ooh, wow! Those are fancy gloves. I better put those on. Very cool. I feel very magical. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Thank you very much. These are. Ha ho, Zuba. You guys ready? Yeah. Magic box? Magic box? Yeah. <laughs> Da -da -da -da. Well, that's nothing. That's just a box. It's a box with no bottom. Okay, that's not. Ah! Oh, check it out. Here we go. It's a box with a tube inside. Hmm. Okay. You know what I think we need, guys? I think we need to use the magic words. Inside, outside, please say the magic words with me, but say them very quietly. Remember, reduce, reuse, recycle. Say them with me. Reduce, reuse, recycle. Let's see if it worked. Oh, goodness gracious. Hello. Check it out, everybody. This is Mel. Mel is a barred owl. Mel is on loan to us from the Anniston Museum of Natural History. He's kind of beautiful, isn't he? Now, Mel is not able to go back out into the wild, so he serves a really cool purpose. He's what they call a creature teacher. Because he's blind in one eye, he wouldn't survive very long back out in the wild. So he shows kids about the natural world. He's a very, very interesting character. He hunts at night. That means he's nocturnal. And he has the most interesting diet. Do you know what he loves to eat? He loves to eat skunks. <laughs> it's true, because he can't smell anything. Right? And they have no defense against Mel. And Mel, seriously, dude, I'm, I'm really glad you haven't had skunk lately for summer. I'm just very glad about that. I'm just saying. And he has special feathers that allow him to fly silently. I think he's an absolutely beautiful bird. Let's give Mel a nice big round of applause. <laughs> Today, we're going to talk about the little you and the big you. What? You're only one you, right? Kind of, sort of. Actually, no, not really. There are always two versions of you, the little you and the big you. That's kind of hard to understand, isn't it? Well, yes it is, but it's true, and this is how it works. Every day when we wake up, we get to choose. Will we act like the little version of ourselves, selfish, mean, or the big version of ourselves, kind, helpful? Each one of us makes this choice every day. The funny thing is, we sometimes forget it's a choice to be big or little. We forget that it's a choice at all. We are not the little version or the big version. We have chosen to be that version of ourselves. Which version is the better version? 
The big version, of course. Can we choose to always be the big version? Hmm, mostly yes. But sometimes it's very, very hard. You've had a bad day, someone was mean to you, and you want to be mean back. That's your choice moment. Do you choose to be big or little? The big version is always better for you and for them. We get to make a choice. You have a little you and a big you. Why choose the big you? Because it makes you a better person. And when you're a better person, you attract other big you people behaving as the best versions of themselves. And that grows and grows and grows until the whole world is covered by big yous. Sometimes we don't make a good choice and we behave like the little you. It happens. When this happens, the best thing to do is to recognize you made a mistake. You were mean or unhelpful or grumpy or ugly or selfish. Apologize. Decide to do better next time because no one is perfect. And guess what? You've now switched yous. You're now the big you again. How awesome is that? So remember, everyone gets to choose each and every day. Are you going to be the little you today or the big you? You decide. <laughs>So ladies and gentlemen, I love to recycle, and recycling is not just a human construct. Recycling happens all throughout the natural world. The air, the land, the water, the plants, the trees, all are recycled. Recycling is basically taking the old and making it new again. Check it out. Let's do some recycling. Take, for instance, Bethany's old dress. Recycling is basically taking the old and making it new again. What do you say we recycle Bethany's dress? So we can take the old dress, put it in the magical recycler, and make it new. What do you think about that? That's a great idea. Awesome. Hey, Bethany, take that old dress off, and we'll put it in the magical recycler and make it new again. What's the matter? So you don't wanna don't wanna take the dress off. So I've got an idea. Let's put all of Bethany in the magical recycler. What do you say? That's a good you like that idea? Oh wait, 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 wait. Those are new shoes, aren't they? Hmm. hmm. You shouldn't try to recycle anything that's new. So I tell you what, Bethany, lose the shoes and they'll have you in your very old dress. Get in the magical recycler. Hey, you guys, wave goodbye. Bye, Bethany. See you later. Bye-bye. Excellent. Let's do some recycling. Check it out. We have to start up the magical recycler. Here we go. Starting up the magical recycler. So recycling is really wonderful. What you have to do is you actually have to Cut the recyclable thing into pieces so you can take it apart and put it back together. Oh, hello. Hello, Bethany. Cut her and put her back together. Uh, oh, boy. That's, yow. That's really, I think that's got to hurt. Don't you think so? Pretty cool, right? Thank you. <laughs> Ta da! Wait a second. Check this out. <laughs> Nice, right? Here we go, check it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That's what we like. Oh, come on, that's really amazing. Give it up for the magical recycler. What do you say we put her back together? Hey, Roz, let's put her back together. No. <laughs> <laughs>
So you remember, recycling is taking the old and making it new again. Man, I hope that dress is okay. Come on, everybody, give it up for Bethany! Man, that's a nice new dress, isn't it? One more time for Bethany! Thank you. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. A mystery. Good. You do? Well, it's my job creating mysteries, and I'm going to need some help to create this mystery. Would you stand up for me, please? You're perfect. Stand right here, if you would. Would you stand up for me, please? What is your name? Hey, Harper, good to see you. Would you come and help us, please? Hey, Harper, I know that's tricky. Why don't you step through there? Hey, Harper, there's a little green star right there. Stand right on the green star and face the audience. Excellent job. Did you tell me your name is Kenny? Kenny King. Kenny King. Kenny King. This is Kenny King, and this is Harper, everybody. Say hello to Kenny King. Say hello to Harper. Now, we created this mystery just for you. Here we go. Stay where you are, guys. Oh, no. These, these have to be straight to hold the board up. Here, do me a favor. Do me, Bethany, yeah, straighten that up so it'll hold the board. Roz, please straighten the trestle because it's got to sit nice and square. Yeah, nice and square. This is going to be fantastic. Ooh. I think this is going to take most of my magic. Let's lose the jacket. Roz, would you take that for me, please? Hey, Kenny, you feeling good? Hold my hand. It's very important that you follow my instructions exactly, okay? Very, very important. I want you to step up onto the steps. Step up here. There is a star right there that is red. I want you to stand right there, and you face the audience just like that. Face the audience. Perfect. Follow my instructions. It's very important for everyone's safety. I promise nothing embarrassing, and I promise no one will get hurt. Are you with me? You're the man. Stay right there. Hey, Harper, you have a lovely smile. <laughs> Would you help me with something? Hold my hand. Step all the way onto the stage. Hey, Harper, turn and face everybody. I'm going to ask you in just a moment to step up the steps and sit on the board facing the audience in your feet. They'll hang off the front. You ready, Harper? Walk up the steps to Bethany's only one, two, sit right there. Oh, you're going to be so fantastic. Hey, Harper, if you would, kick your feet up here and lay down on the board. That's a girl. Now lay all the way back. Make yourself comfortable. All right. Scooch that way a little bit. I've got a really comfortable pillow for you. Perfect. Hey, Harper, take your left hand and wave to the audience. Let them know you're okay. Good job. Hey, Harper, take both of your hands and put them behind your head. Now, I want you to relax. Close your eyes. Relax, Harper. This is going to be a lot of fun. While Harper is relaxing, Kenny, you doing okay? Stay right there, buddy. Harper, please take both of your arms and cross them across your chest. Perfect. Breathe in very deeply. Breathe out. Breathe in. Breathe out. Harper, close your eyes, please. Kenny, walk over to Harper and hold this board. Hold it here, hold it here. When I say go, you and Bethany are going to lower the board to the floor right there. Then you're going to walk back over to your star. It's really important you put it in the right place. So focus 
on the floor. Ready? Hold her up. Hold her up. Here we go. Hold her up high. Don't let her go. Set the board down. Go back to your star now. Great, Harper. Stay there. Keep your eyes closed. Eyes closed. Nicely done there, Harper. You're doing great, kiddo. Stay right where you are. Stay where you are. You're doing great. Kenny, go grab the board. Slide it back underneath Harper. Slide it back up here. Nicely done. Right back underneath. Harper, open your eyes. Sit up. Wave to everybody so they know you're OK. Excellent. Harper, lift your legs off there. Step down the ladder. One, two, Three, take a giant step to the right, and let's take a big bow to thunderous applause. Ready? Yeah. Yeah. Remember, everybody, be good, be amazing, and don't be mean.